The next one uh, is about, I put this in a section called uh, Timing is Everything. It's moving objects now. And I'll give you a little background before I show you the picture. Uh, I went with my son Stephen and a couple of friends to go shoot the football game, Penn State USC in 2009. Uh, we knew there was going to be a flyover and figured we'd go have fun, take pictures and see if we can get the flyover. I knew what time, I knew basically what I wanted to do, but I had no idea if I'd even see it. Well, it worked and we got a nice picture of it. So uh, we sent this out, I sent this out to a group of aviators who sent it to other people and it started going and uh, that was one direction. The other direction is we sent it to Sports Illustrated and my son sends it to Boris Illustrated and says, why don't you put this on the front cover? <laughs> well, anyway, at, uh, Sunday morning, a couple days later, at 6.30 in the morning, I get a call from Sports Illustrated say, send us the picture now. So I'm jumping around crazy figuring where the picture is and all this stuff. And we got it to them, and we did get a two-page spread with the Sports Illustrated. The day before that, I'm sorry, Monday, before the, it came out in the newspapers, uh, I get a call from uh, Tournament of Roses. And I had never talked to the guy before, and he started like, how the hell did your picture get to Washington, D.C.? Can I get a copy of your picture so I can give it to our congressman, our state senator, actually, Diane Feinstein? And I said, no, I'll give it to her. And so I flew out, to, actually, I did fly to Washington, D.C., and I gave it to her, and it was a wonderful experience. This also went on to uh, Sports Illustrated, sent it a World Press photo and it came in second out of 106,000 pictures in World Press Photo. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.